What time is it, my creatives? That's right, it's photo hacking time. So today, a uh, request from Ashley on Facebook um, wants to know how to take a photo, convert it into a silhouette, and then export it as an F S SVG. So that is what we're going to do today. So I have from the internet downloaded a beautiful picture of Kristen Stewart. Now, in order for this to work, you're going to need a high res image. This will not work on photos that, uh, that you take off your phone or low res photos. You need to have a high resolution photo, at least 300 dots per inch, you know, a good size photo to do this with enough contrast. Um, because if you don't, it won't work. So, the first step that we're gonna do is you're gonna open up the picture in Photoshop, of course, okay? So here I have the lovely uh, uh, Kirsten Stewart here. Now, okay, so what we're gonna do, first things first, is we're gonna go to Image, Adjustments, we're gonna go to Posterize. We're going to go to select Level 5. Okay, and then we're going to go to image adjustments threshold. And there you have silhouette of lovely Kristen Stewart. Okay, so now the next thing that we're going to do, we're going to save this out as a JPEG and we're going to take it into Illustrator and convert it into a vector. Okay. So I'm gonna go file, save as. Now we have it saved to our desktop. We're gonna open it and Illustrator. And here it is. So I'm gonna scale this down a little bit because it's a little bit too large. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to the corners and shift click and drag it down. Okay, that's pretty simple. And that's it. Just cancel that. Now we're gonna go to image, trace. Now you have to select it to affect it. And you're gonna go to high fidelity photo, select that and it'll do its thing. Then you're going to hit expand, and then it's going to expand it. Then you're going to go to object, ungroup, okay? And then you're gonna select the background and delete it, okay? So now you just have this silhouette, and that is it, okay? Now you're gonna group it together, object group, and then now you can save it as a, an SVG. So you can save as SVG. Go to the desktop and I'm gonna just name it one. Kristen. Save. And there's lots of different options here. Um, but we're just going to save it like that and then press OK. And we're going to go to the desktop and see what we got. So here's what we have on the desktop. So I'm going to open it with Chrome. And I'm sorry I have two screens, so I'm just going to drag it over here. And there is your SVG from the photo. I hope you like this tutorial. If you like this, please subscribe. Hit the bell button so that you can receive notifications. You can find me at... Uh, YouTube, Photo Hack Lovers, Twitter, Photo Hack Lovers, Facebook, Photo Hack Lovers. I'll leave the links below. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. You guys have a great night.